YouTube, what's good? It's your boy Wavy. I know this is my channel, Mr. Orchard Beach. If you're new to the channel and you haven't hit the subscribe button yet, hit that subscribe button, like, comment, all the above. You know me, can't stay in the crib. Doesn't mean I can't social distance, so I don't want to hear all your. Uh, uh, shut the up. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, before we get this vid, 400 likes on this joint. I just got to get out. Um, you already know. Juice bar. No, what am I going to do first? I'm going to go to the graffiti spot first, so I'm going to go a different route. I want some Jamaica food today. Last week, I was um, tripping. I didn't go, but I know a spot that I want to hit up, so I'm going to hit that spot up. It's fairly close. Well, it's, it's around um, the Castle Hill area, so. Uh, kill two birds with one stone, but yeah, so Man, what we're gonna chat about I want to talk about Snoop Dogg's top 10 list I, I do want to talk about that joint Definitely, you already know I like talking about other things They ain't always gotta be sneaks Even though it always does If the sneaks is fly, you know what I'm saying? Oh yo, but anyway, shout out to my sponsor for the mask and the tea Into the AM, you already know Use my link, my, uh, pin it below Appreciate y'all, y'all save 10% off uh, all your purchases and don't forget about that t-shirt club where you get what free t-shirt just for signing up uh after that t-shirts are $14.95 a month but anyway after all that i'm gonna get a ghetto car wash i would get a regular one but i got the feeling that i'm not gonna be driving that much this week so uh ghetto car wash it is looking for those open hydrants anyway yo follow me out I already know that I'm the hardest Sometimes there's no emotion, I'm a hardest The bottom of the bottom's where the start is And well I know it, it's like being a good father To a son, cause I've never been a son To a good father Young boy trying to make it up, uh-huh I've done too much, but show me love Show me, show me Cause you see me online, it don't mean you know me I don't need a bus down and take the plane rolly I don't need no fake friend, I'd rather be here lonely Ever see my name in your phone, better pick it up Put my pride in a hole, I'ma dig it up, bro Put the probe in the wrist, we gon' build it up My life a movie Oh shit, you see they starting to um clear up the damn graffiti New joints about to come up soon Damn, I don't even know if I'm gonna be able to get a slot out here, boy They out here <laughs> Alright, so I did get a spot Probably not in the position that I wanted, pause, but we good. So anyway, uh, let's talk about this damn list. So Snoop Dogg made a list of his top MCs of all time. I saw some like laughter, a lot of responses. Now, I'm not here trying to like give nobody no bail or nothing like that or try to like ride on Snoop like, yo, he, he said it's his list, but he did say it's his list. He said it's his list. He said, my top MCs of all time. I don't even give a damn about the underneath where he put mine's not yours, but See, those lists are very subjective. It could always go about like the error. Cause I remember I had somebody, one time I asked a, a, a cat, this dude was probably in, well in his 50s. I was like, yo, who's the greatest rapper of all time? This nigga tell me, the Lost Poets. I don't know about that. I was like, come on, you know what I'm saying? But, um, all right, so, um, very subjective. How do I want to do this? What do I want to talk about? Do I want to talk about his list or just go? Well, yeah, let me just talk about his list first and then, then we'll get to it. So, I don't think he had any type of order out here. The first thing I was looking for, I was like, damn, he got any West Coast artists on this joint? And, you know, yeah. Now, um, so his first, uh, his first top MC of all time, his first favorite, or whatever, I'm just going to say favorite. Well, not first, but Slick Rick. Okay, given that era, if you go on all, and this looks like the 80s era, like prior to him, like really getting in hip hop in the 80s, like who, okay, Slick Rick, definitely, uh, only had like about three, oh, well, I ain't, we ain't gonna get into that, but yeah, Slick Rick, Ice Cube, we go West Coast, uh, Ice Cube, our shit, after he broke from NWA, yeah, uh, Lethal Injection, America's Most Wanted, shit, shit. Uh, yeah, I mean you can still go. You can st uh, not lethal injection. Um, death certificate. Like, come on. Yeah, Ice Cube. I, I see that. LL Cool J. Best that ever did it. I'm just keeping it real. Football. KRS One. Shit. Where we at? So you think that hip hop had this start out in Queensbridge? If you pop that junk up in the Bronx, you might not live. You know what I'm saying? You think I'm not gonna say KRS One? Yeah. Like I said, in that '80s era. Rock him. Rum from Run DMC and D, D from DMC. Um, 
Yeah, uh, that was funny. He said D from DMC. All cuts are on time and rhymes connect. Got the right to vote and Willie Beck. And other rappers can't stand us, but give us respect. <laughs> uh, Pioneer Group. I guess you could kind of like say around that time it was very early in hip hop so it wasn't that many groups out but not to say that even if there was a lot of groups out there they just wouldn't be there yeah they did crossovers uh walk this way uh king of rock i remember at first i was like damn are they going rock you know what i'm saying but um now if i was talking about me if i was talking about like 80s 80s rappers I didn't really live that era like of age so no i definitely they, i'm not gonna say definitely but uh run for dmc and D, they wouldn't be in that on uh, that list respectful yeah i would respect them definitely now you got big daddy kane hell yeah um as a matter of fact i remember um watching something where jam, i think it was jam acid who somebody had like kind of like a it wasn't really a battle they just wanted to see him flow and jam master j told the cat that was rapping like um uh, on the you know that wasn't on dmc he was like yo don't diss him you know what i'm saying so i kind of felt when i heard that i don't know i i just heard the story and i'm forgetting who who, who he told that to i'm put it up there definitely when i heard that story it tells me it's like, all right, and now if you're telling somebody that, don't diss them. It's like, you don't think that they can hit them with that comeback. Because I know definitely you're not telling uh, uh, somebody, yo, don't diss uh, KRS-One or don't diss Rakim or <laughs> Daddy Kane. You know what I'm saying? Like, don't diss them. Like, nah, because they'll come back. But that was kind of strange to me, you know. But the other rapper, you know, he respected uh, Jam Master J enough not to. Ice-T, one of gangsta. the godfathers of gangster rap, that West Coast era. I've definitely gone back and listened to some of his joints you know, over the years. Because, like I said, that was, like, ahead of my time. And, you know, his records, you know, I wasn't really allowed to play them like that. But, yeah, six in them. Well, that's, you know, off gate. Fresh to be sweep across the bathroom. definitely see ice he west coast pioneer gangster to the fullest smooth cat he even had a joint on um, feds in my rear view i'm like yo how this 60 year old cat still rapping like this you know what i'm saying like i ain't saying it was lyricist of the year but that shit wasn't whack like you know what i'm saying that shit was like um any type of like major league baseball or major league sports oh yo uh check that nigga for peds word up like for real yeah but um yeah definitely and then he got uh too short pimp told that story on the bay area how that pimp shit was really going nasty as he wanted to be with them damn rhymes but yeah i'm glad that he put that it was his list like my top five he didn't say these are the greatest of all times he said this is my top five because i think when people or oh, my top 10 i'm sorry i think when people put out like they be like oh my top five i think they try to make you think that what they're saying is this is my top five but they'll put it in a way that it's like who's the top five of all time which could still be subjective you know what i'm saying it could be an argument y'all what's better playstation or xbox you know like yeah because then i get really confused like when people put this top five this is one i always see biggie put in the order biggie Pac, um nas j scarface are you saying that they're the greatest of all time or are you trying to tell us that that's your top five favorite artists of all time now so i kind of disagree with your with your uh super list right there you know what i'm saying like i don't know because i remember at one point hell I, uh in high school i used to listen well middle school i used to listen to a lot of what um like west coast west coast artists like easy e, q like them with my two but then it seemed like the west coast had kind of like faded out that east coast it took over i liked jay even though I, I wasn't really i was real young you know i said that reasonable doubt it was still like some smooth shit, like a little over my head what do you say but nori was my favorite rapper i remember uh i'm so excited that's first off when that war report came out nori was my favorite rapper um at a point, Common was um, one of my favorite rappers. Who else? Nori Common. I forget, cause like, all like, going like to what my favorite was, it, it would switch a lot. But I only see two things, well, I say three things wrong with that list. That D, the Run DMC, and he didn't have Cool G Rap up in there. Cool G Rap got spit, you know what I'm saying? Like, for real. This is a Kit Kat, small as a Tic Tac, but I'm a Big Mac. Cause I'm G but anyway, man, 
Um, I'm down here at this uh, graffiti spot. I'm gonna get a uh, flick right quick, and then I'm gonna hit this damn Jamaican spot. I'm still like teetering. I'm like, damn, do I want to go out and get something to eat? But I really don't want to be out around no crowd. Go, 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 From what I can like help myself being like, you know, that's why um, you see. Oh man, I had got an alert today on my phone. At first, I was like, what the fuck? I was dreaming. It was like, oh, your boarding pass is ready. I don't know what the fuck up with Delta because I already got my damn uh, refund. But yeah, man, strange times we're living in, man. No flights, no time soon. But anyway, man, um, take this flick. You already know. After this, hit this Jamaican spot. Uh, Sean Long gone. Somebody bring him back. He's moving too fast. Somebody bring him crack. He's moving even faster. Somebody bring him dope. Fucked up in the dirt. Somebody bring him soap. Clean up my act. Write a few violent songs. But they whack like Glenn Rice with new balance on. No peace, no home, it's broken The chain you stole, it's frozen Yeah, we came from the blocks and the six on The snakes and the fakes and the brick phones I went to school with him, now he's got a headstone And the end is full of chicks, so the best no The pain kings used to keep us in friends' hoes Only talking to the guys in the band souls How can I live my best life if my friends die? I'm trying to buy the fucking jets so the ends fly I'm trying to buy the fucking Block so the ends mine. So saying all right, he could death, but it's then time. So many siblings in the yard, my mama's working hard. So I'ma be the one to have a shine like a star. Uh, to have a shine like a star. Alright, so I'm out here in front of King Sunshine. I know it's a line, but I ain't really that pressed to jump up in there. But um, yeah, so I got put onto this joint. It was me spooking um and pee. We used to go to that um, club right there or that lounge. And I remember like, yo, getting up out of there drunk and shit, we used to be hungry as hell. And yo, that spot's popping. Especially the end of flavors popping too. Like the um the rice, shit, the rice and peas. Oh, Lord! Yeah, let me fall up in here right quick. Uh, shout out to Effectus, man, we're just texting. Yo, I ain't know he had whips like that. Oh, and don't forget to use my discount code, Wavy, save 25%. When don't you use my discount code? When they got 40%. <laughs> Right, 400 likes on this joint, man. I'm about to dig in, word. Oh yeah, don't worry, I got the hot sauce. Shout out to the Wave Mob, everybody that's been rocking with me. Be back soon, y'all ready? Follow me on that Snap, follow me on that IG, follow me on that Twitter. That Twitter be... But that snaps. It's your boy Wavy, y'all already know this is my channel, Mr. Beach. Like I always like to say, see you when I see you. Ow.